Hello, welcome back to Remote Hustle HQ. It's your girl Saranda coming back with you with a job lead. I actually have a few job leads that I am going to be sharing with you. I'm going to start and get right into it so I won't waste your time. But I'm going to start with the company called Sedgwick. We have discussed Sedgwick before. And for you all that are looking for a more global opportunity, this is um, one of the companies I talked about before in my video, um, nine companies that are always hiring. Sedgwick was one of them. Also check out my other video where I'm discussing worldwide opportunities. In that video, I'm discussing companies that are hiring worldwide. They are American companies hiring worldwide. And I go over different companies that you can work for because I know a lot of people are looking for other opportunities outside of the United States. They may not live there. And so those two videos will kind of guide you with different companies that you can work for if you don't reside in the United States. Sedgwick is a global company, so you might have an opportunity to work in different positions um, here, job leads um, positions with Sedgwick. So go ahead, if you know that you are looking for that, check out the company Sedgwick. And as you go on their website, they explain to you that they are a global company. They also provide a lot of remote opportunities, flexible schedules that you might wanna go ahead and look into. Um, and they will let you know if it's a global opportunity or something in the United States. And so I just wanted to kind of go over that. They are based out of US and Canada, but again, they are having a lot of great opportunities for you that you can just go around and click on. Um, and as you click on the different tabs up here, then they'll tell you, you know, the different locations that you can work from anywhere. And right now, these are the different countries. They have a plethora of different um, countries that they're working out of here. They um, are, some of them are listed here for you. So you kind of just want to go and look around on Sedgwick. They have a lot of great opportunities and they have job opportunities across the world is global. Um, and so going back to their employ, um, explore opportunities tab, then you will be able to pick, hey, I want an entry level opportunity. And so I will be going over a few entry level opportunities with them today. And I just kind of wanted to show you how to go around. Also, if you are looking for claims examiner, they have a lot of claims examiner jobs. So if you have experiences with that, you kind of want to go ahead and go on this website and check out what they have. They have customer service, disability representative. If you have a background in engineering or a degree in engineering or tech or IT um, and so forth, they even have nursing jobs and they offer a lot of um, opportunities to work from home. Some are hybrid where you, you would be at home and also in the office if that is something that you're interested in. And they also have in-office jobs. If you know, you, hey, I see a job in my area or my city, then they offer a lot of different jobs for everybody. And so this is a good company to check out. And let's go ahead and um, go into some of the things that I have um, already pulled up for you. Right now, they are hiring for a call center representative. This position is work from home, is telecommute. These are the locations currently that they're hiring for for this particular position. And as you know, as a call center representative, you will be on the phone. These are the other locations. Um, that they are hiring for. For this particular position, it is part-time. They posted this some time ago, um, but it's still available for those that are saying, hey, I wanna work part-time at home. Um, and you will be on the phone, you'll do customer service, problem solving skills. Um, and as you see here, you'll be resolving the issues with one call or one person and you'll be on the phone. So if you know that, hey, I don't mind being 
on the phone as a claims um, examiner is still saying that you'll do some type of claims um, in resolving customers problems is your main goal and role for this position all you have to have is a high school diploma for this call center representative with Sedgwick and uh, they don't mention the pay your typical pay when I researched it it starts at at least $18 per hour um, you can go ahead and Google the you know Google the pay or if you get the interview or if you're interested in this role just ask the hiring manager hey I noticed that the pay was not listed what is the pay for this position but as you Google it um, call center representative on Google the base pay for these type of roles start at at least 17 to 18 dollars per hour so if you're interested in a part-time position work from home with sedgwick go ahead and check out this opportunity with sedgwick call center representative the next opportunity that i have pulled up for you guys these are all entry level positions and they're all remotes work from home based positions these positions right here you don't have to have any experiences and so this opportunity for an administrative assistant is part-time so if you're looking for a part-time role then i'm going over a couple of part-time non-experienced entry level roles that you can work with sedgwick and right now they have a uh, administrative assistant and you'll be doing reporting filing and administrative and clerical roles processing data um, filing um, and they have it where you can do filing online now you will be a providing uh, you will be a backup to the telephone support so with this position you won't be on the phones a lot but you will be a backup for that if they need it um, you'll be dealing with invoices and billing and maintaining records and making travel arrangements. Sometimes you'll be recording the meetings, minutes, you know, clerical role. And all you have to have for this position in a, is a high school diploma or a GED. Again, Sedgwick doesn't mention the pay for this position. They do have... Um, um, some health benefits and they do want you to have some knowledge for um, this role as administrative assistant they want you to have oral and written communication skills strong organization skills and so forth so a lot of clerical administrative skills so if you know hey I want to work part-time and I do have administrative clerical skills then this might be the opportunity for you and again they did not list the pay for sedgwick for this but i did research this one and for the administrative um, position which says sedgwick it typically pays anywhere from 38k to 53k so you do want to definitely want to negotiate the 53 um k 53,000 a year salary if you know hey i got the experience i can do this and plus it's just part-time so you can find this on glassdoor they typically give you a median pay um, for certain careers at any um, company so you definitely want to check that out and that's for the administrative assistant job the next job with sedgwick is going to pay a little bit higher um, this one is for a liability claims examiner and you can go ahead and know all the different jobs that they're hiring they're consistently hiring with Sedgwick so this is a great company if you're looking for worldwide opportunities like I said across the globe go on their website they have a lot of different jobs available this one is the liability claims examiner remote you'll be doing some customer service as well this is a no phone job position you'll be um, um, dealing with strategic planning you'll be like a team lead person they do want you to have some experience with this role and you'll be handling claims like helping the customers get their claims and benefits with this role so they do want you to have some experience it says five years of liability claims management experience required so for this role they kind of want you to be 
experience and if you say hey i don't have five years experience but i do have some experience with customer claims and you know administrative of solving problems and administrative skills then i encourage you to apply because a lot of the jobs will give you training all jobs have to train you for a certain amount of time to do a specific role and so if you know you're going through some of the um um, skills that they want go ahead and note that on your resume say hey I got customer claim skills I have customer representative skills or I know how to virtually help people I know how to be organized I have professional development um, skills and experience you know then put that on your resume um, as to say hey I have related experience and skills to get this role and now with Sedgwick, I noticed they're not putting the pay. And so I did research this one as well. Typical pay for a claimed examiner experience, you can make up to 87,000 K per year. And it will start at 57 K per year. I am assuming the 57 K is if you have little to no experience as a claim examiner, but as always try to negotiate the 87 K a year when you're working the jobs, always try to negotiate, you know, the higher pay. If you know that you have some experience or done the job before. So this is going to be your typical pay at Sedgwick for any claims examiner job. So I did do the research. You can find this on Glassdoor. My last um, role that I was gonna go over is there is an opportunity with Chicks Filet. Now this one is for a customer support agent. This is, you don't have to have little to no experience for this. They did want some experience. And this typical role pays at least 20 to $30 per hour after doing the research on it. Um, you can go ahead and Google that also. But right now they have an opportunity for a Chick-fil-A customer support agent one. And so this is kind of like an entry level position in this role. You'll be doing customer inquiries, customer support and via um, chat or, you know, email. There is some phones that they mention, but it doesn't mention very um, much phones as you read the summary. Um, but this is 100% at home, even though it is based out of Atlanta, as you go down to the bottom or through the summary, it lets you know that this job is work from home. Um, and so that is something that you want to discuss with the hiring manager, but they do provide, you know, remote opportunities here and they do give the option of a mix from working in person and remotely. But for this position, it is remote as you read the responsibilities. And so let's go over some more of the responsibilities. They, it's a lot of customer service skills that you have to have with this position. Of course, you're serving customers, you're resolving customer issues and their questions. And that is what you're basically doing with this customer support um, agent role with Chicks filet um, for this position, it says minimum experience is zero, so you do not have to have any experience. So if you do have a degree, it is a plus. So go ahead and check out this uh, position. These are the hours for this position according to Eastern Standard Time. Um, they do want you to be able to type, um, have a little bit of tech skills, but if you don't, that's okay. So go ahead and get out on this a job lead because remote jobs always go pretty fast. And you guys, that is all I have to um, share with you today. So make sure that you apply to one of these great opportunities. We want to go ahead and check their website out. They have a lot of great opportunities with Sedgwick and Chick-fil-A. And that are the, those are the job leads that I have to share with you guys. And I will see you all next time. Until then, go ahead and get on these job leads and have a great day.